Uh, I swear I have tried to film this video like 20 times and I have that footage and I have not uploaded done anything so I'm just gonna do that today and hopefully I get it done but anyway um kitty Lou 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 anyway <sighs> okay so uh okay all right time um Anyway, let's get right on it. It the in May, which is this month, um, I completed my 18 months of braces, and time went by really fast. Time went by really slow. Um, so basically, what they've been doing is just kind of the, the same thing they were doing last time, just kind of closing holes, making spaces, pushing teeth back. Uh, I keep getting this weird um, gap between uh, my front tooth and the lateral incisor. Um, don't want to do a close-up, so I'll just put a picture in there at some point. And really, I think now what's happening is they're just they're just making sure that it's like a final placement for the teeth. Um, and then what's going to happen is hopefully I'll get x-rays done soon. And then if I'm okay, then I think they're just going to take the braces off. Uh, but that's not going to happen until October or something. He said the fall, so whenever that is in the fall. Uh, there is a wedding that I'm going to be in in June, actually two, and I didn't want to have braces. I was praying, praying, praying that I would have my braces off by now, but it didn't happen. Um, some YouTubers that I've watched and followed, you know, they got their braces off in a year and a half, almost two, and, you know, I'm already at that uh, year and a half mark, and once you pass that year bump, you just, it just all goes downhill from there. I mean, my braces thing stopped being exciting after my... I think after my eighth month or my ninth month just because all the teeth were kind of where I wanted them to be and then um everything after that was just kind of small detailing and yeah that's kind of what that was but overall uh I am really happy with the progress uh it's just now I'm just I don't want to say that um I'm a different person but I now feel like just nothing's holding me back um not like insecurities and everybody has their insecurities you know some people are you know have weight issues some people have skin issues some people have just it, i mean it just depends you know and so mine was just my smile my i thought that was like the biggest issue ever and um you know sappy sappy story i just kind of let that you know run how i lived my life i guess so now that um, I'm doing something about it, you know, I just feel so much better. I feel happier. I just feel free. That's a really good word to say it, I guess. I feel free. Um, so yeah, that's, that's it's cool. Um, anyway, so that's just kind of like a quick update, I guess. There's nothing really super important or drastic like that. That's why I haven't updated. I don't know. I guess the next time um, I really do an in-depth film will be... You know, I'll do like before pictures, I'll do after pictures, I'll do the whole shebang. But for now, I guess like my old videos are there and I know they're kind of weird. I mean, I'm not the best like filmmaker. I don't have all these special effects and all this stuff, you know. I'm just kind of out here telling my story and um, I like to go back and watch my own videos. You know, it's, I know it's weird and there's a lot of them that are private just because, you know, they were just meant for me, but I'm putting them somewhere, you know, and then maybe one day I'll... I'll make them public, but otherwise it's just uh, it's just me and teeth and gear, really. Uh, weird because it's just every time you go into the orthodontist, especially with braces, it's just the, everything is so abrasive. Like five hands are on your mouth. Okay, I'm exaggerating, but there's just all there are just all these like people around touching your face and oh come look at this nurse and oh look at this and look at this and no well, not nurse I'm not a hospital but my dental assistants or whatever so it's just weird you know I would never open my mouth and then and now I'm opening it for people to put things in and oh yeah I got these two little like bracket thingies on the inside of my teeth like on the inside of my mouth not the outside of the tooth but the inside because like these bottom this bottom gap that I have down here it's just not closing it doesn't want to um that one right that one right there so um they put like uh, some brackets on the inside 
and I think they're uh, my next appointment they're gonna tie those two together and really push them together it's like weird gap that I have is right there it's so weird and this gap closer to y'all and you know I hope hopefully I get like a wire t I get ties to kind of close that gap also Come on. And then so many people have already gotten their braces off. When I started my braces journey, I was watching all these like really cool people on on YouTube and inspiring because they were adults like me and they were kind of going through it. You know, they were showing me like a snapshot of the future, of my future. And now they have their braces off and it's so exciting. So, you know, I hope that I become one of those people that someone just got braces watches, you know. Um, so they can kind of see, you know, what the, what the di diliozo is, the, di the dilio is, whatever. Um, but if you have any, like, questions or anything, just comment below, whatever. But, uh, I don't know what else to kind of do an update on. No one really asked for any updates. You know, no one really, I don't know one gives a shit, it's just me. But, um, that's why I don't know what to, what to say. It's just kind of weird. Um, uh, but anyway uh i did also want to try out my new camera i got a new camera um i really like it so that's kind of another reason why i'm doing the video but if you have any questions or anything just let me know and i'm here obviously so have a good one